Mathematics is the music of reason. James Joseph Sylvester, imagine a mathematician equipped with an infinitely sharp knife and a perfect sphere. She deftly slices the sphere into countless pieces, distributing them across infinite boxes. Then, in a feat that seems impossible, she rearranges the pieces into five sections. With precision and elegance, she reassembles these into two identical, flawless replicas of the original sphere. This mind-bending phenomenon is known as the Bainock-Tarski paradox. The paradox isn't rooted in faulty logic or incorrect proofs. Both are impeccable. Instead, it challenges our understanding of reality and what mathematics truly represents. To grasp this, we must start at the foundation of all mathematics, axioms. Axioms are the bedrock of every mathematical system. These fundamental truths, accepted without proof, provide the starting point for all logical deductions. Many axioms align with our intuitive understanding of the world, like the principle that adding zero to a number doesn't change it. However, by altering these foundational assumptions, entirely new mathematical systems can emerge, each as valid and robust as the original. Consider Euclid's geometry, which posits that through any given point not on a line, only one parallel line exists. Later mathematicians, questioning this axiom, develop spherical and hyperbolic geometries. These alternative systems prove not only logically sound, but also incredibly useful in various contexts. Enter the axiom of choice, a controversial yet essential principle in modern mathematics. It allows for the selection of elements from infinite sets, even when the choices seem indistinguishable. Picture infinite boxes filled with identical marbles. The axiom of choice acts as an all-knowing chooser, ensuring consistent selections despite our inability to distinguish the marbles ourselves. In the Banach-Tarski paradox, this axiom is critical. When faced with infinitely many indistinguishable parts, the axiom of choice enables the construction of the five sections necessary to replicate the sphere. Without it, the paradox would be impossible. But should we reject an axiom that leads to such counterintuitive outcomes? The answer is a resounding no. While the axiom of choice results in abstract scenarios like the Banach-Tarski paradox, it also underpins vital areas of mathematics, including measure theory and functional analysis. These fields have practical applications in statistics, physics, and beyond. Mathematics accommodates both systems with and without the axiom of choice. Like Euclidean and hyperbolic geometries, these frameworks coexist, each suited to specific purposes. The choice of axioms depends on the context and the goals of the mathematician. This freedom to choose axioms reflects the essence of mathematics. It's not merely a tool to model the physical universe, but also a gateway to exploring abstract realms and alternative realities. If we ever encounter extraterrestrial life, their mathematical axioms might seem as alien to us as ours would to them. Perhaps they would take our infinitely sharp knife and perfect sphere and reveal new dimensions of mathematical wonder. For more videos, please like and subscribe.